What up, it's your boy Nick from MMA Pixels here with Freddie Calvo from 209 Beatdown 4, January 6, 2018. Freddie will be taking on Owen Pettit. How are you doing, Freddie? I'm doing pretty well. Thank you for uh, taking your time out of your training to speak with us today. Yeah, sure. Uh, thank you for having the time for me. I know you're currently 1-0. Um, your, your competition, Olin, is is 1-0. and But you guys both have a lot of hype behind you. Do you feel like this is a big fight for you? Uh, the second one, yeah, because I want to do better than what I, uh, how I did on the on the first one. Because, you know, on my, on my first fight, it was, you know, it was the first time that I, I was fighting in a, in a, I fought before in a cage, but it was, a, you know, it was a long time ago. And I was, uh, it wasn't for camo, and, you know, this one was basically the, you say, legit first fight that I've ever had as it comes to full on MMA. So, you know, you have the butterflies, and, you know, you don't know what to expect, the weigh-ins, you know, everything. So, I'm trying to do better than how I did on the first one, uh, as it comes to, you know, keeping your emotions you can stay out of control okay do you felt like uh i guess they call it the adrenaline dump oh yeah yeah i felt that so now on the second fight you think that all the all those feelings are going to be out of the way it's going to be kind of more normal you know what to expect uh well i think that they're still going to be there but you know I, now i know kind of what to expect in a way um, are you doing any, like, Olin's really good at jiu-jitsu. I believe he's won a world's title. Are you doing anything different to prepare for him? Uh, well, we've, we've, uh, we've always been training uh, both, uh, you know, stand-up and our ground game. And uh, my, you could say that my, uh, that, I, that I do mainly jiu-jitsu, you know, that's like our thing. But, uh, you know, I'm trying to improve my stand-up quite a bit. Are you looking forward to a more stand-up, or are you just ready for whatever? Well, I'm ready for whatever, but I'm trying to see if uh, maybe I could, uh, you know, show off more of what I can do uh, without my stand-up, especially since, you know, he has a height advantage for me. Um, how often are you training in preparation uh, for this? Uh, we train uh, Monday through Friday. Oh, one time a day, or? No, no, uh, yeah, once a day, every day. Oh, that's pretty intense. Yeah. yeah. Um, how about weight? We have uh, same-day weigh-ins. Are you pretty much on, on fight weight? Yeah, currently, right now, I'll probably wake up at uh, 140, uh, 147 or so. So, yeah, I'm almost, you could say, there. And then, going forward after this, this matchup, do you, what do you see in the future? Well, you know, I got a uh, great partners, uh, training partners that are uh, are coming up. You know, Frank Farmer and uh, Mr. Rob Davis, and you know, they're they're uh, they're they going up there to become a pro, and I'm right there with them. Right. Yeah. I uh, I was just talked to to Robert earlier, and uh, he mentioned some of the same same names you did. Uh, is there anybody else you want to give a shout out to out, out of that gym? Well, of course, uh, you know, Sensei Primo, he's the a, he's a head over there. And, you know, we got Rob, we got Frank, who are all, you know, great people. And also uh, Neil Johnson, who's uh, just a great uh, trainer, you know? Mm -hmm. Right, yeah, I mean, it's, it's a solid team over there. It It's kind of crazy. We have little teams here and there throughout Northern California, but they produce, like, this top talent. Like, if you hear the name... You know that that talent, you know that fighter's legit. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. So I, I'm excited for this. I know, um, like I said, Olin has a lot of hype behind him as well, and it, it's uh, you guys are very young in your careers, and, and I can't wait to see what happens. Yeah, yeah, same here, man. You know, I got a. Uh, thankfully, I got a few uh, sponsors that have been a uh, very, very. Uh, they've been helping out a lot. You know, support. Supporting me, you know, R and R development and um Butch Joanna over at Seaside. We got um Native Coast Landscapes. You know, they've they've been very supportive of me, you know. Uh they they've been to uh my training, they've seen what I do and I just wanna make sure that uh 
we got the names out there because you know they've been very, very supportive of what I do, especially especially in our development. Uh, the guy, the head of the company guy, uh, he came to my fight and was, I mean, it was just a great support to have him there. And yeah, that's awesome. It's great to hear companies supporting uh, local fighters who are able to, you know, kind of do their dream and and do MMA, and that's what makes things possible. So. For me, thank you to those companies. I appreciate it. Yeah. Is there a... Where can the fans connect with you on social media? Well, they can uh, connect through me to, uh, to uh, Instagram mainly at S7Official. Yep. Well, I appreciate your time, Freddie. 209 Beatdown 4, January 6th, Stockton Memorial Civic Auditorium. Freddie will be taking on Olin Pettit. I can't wait. Thank you again, Freddie. Thank you.